What is up guys, the inside of Roblox Islands, and today I'm going to show you guys how to beat the Fan 1 boss. I know that it's been out for a while, but just for y those of you who have recently been able to get there uh, after the bug fix, where you wouldn't be able to go to the Fan 1 boss, I'm going to show you guys how to. Now, I'm going to bring uh, extra stuff, you don't really need all of this, uh, but I'm just going to show you guys what you should bring. So first of all, you should probably bring a ruby staff, a spell book, or a tile spell book. Um, just something that's magic, uh, that has a high damage. Uh, preferably the ruby staff, but if you don't have um, the ruby staff, you can just go with the spell book or a title. Um, but basically you just need one of the magic uh, weapons. You're also going to want um, the best melee weapon that you have. For me, this is the Infernal Hammer, uh, so that's pretty nice. You don't really need a pickaxe, I just have it in my normal loadout. Uh, you're going to need the strongest axe that you have, uh, and you'll see why in a minute. Uh, you might want to bring a bow, but it doesn't really all help all that much, especially if your archery uh, skill isn't that high, just like mine. You're going to want at least one star fruit cake, uh, and uh, if possible, you should also try to get something that increases your speed, but it's not absolutely necessary. If you don't have a ruby staff, you're also going to want to get uh, an item that has um, a high healing, such as the berry pancakes. Um, so, just keep that in mind. But, we're going to go over to the Maple Islands now, and we're going to start. So we're just going to talk to Bailey real quick, so that way the uh, door opens up. Uh, I don't like how they kind of do that. We're just going to eat a chili pepper real quick. Just that way we can go faster. And before you start the battle, always make sure to have your starfruit cake. Um, so that's where you're going to use your starfruit cake there. And we're going to just go over right here. We'll get that one raspberry. Nice. Um, we're going to travel to Fanhorn. And here we go. So, uh, if you don't have your starfruit cake on yet, again, keep it on. Uh, because you're going to need the extra damage. And now, uh, luckily I kind of got launched towards the boss, but you're just going to want to take your magic weapon and run towards the boss and just start spamming it. Uh, now, the melee weapon is if uh, you're having the issue where uh, the, the magic isn't loading properly. Uh, you know, the old glitch where it kind of just stays still. Now, this time we're actually getting a very good run because he's not really moving all that much. Uh, so we're just going to hit him with the Infernal Hammer a little bit. Um, there we go. Now, if he is to run away, then that's when you're going to use your bow, if you brought one. See, so here we go. We're just going to snipe him from afar, so that way we can do a little bit of damage. It's not that much. And here's where you're going to need your axe. Now, I don't actually have to cut this down, since he's so low. Uh, I can simply just start killing him again. Um, but, if he was not all that low, or if he just keeps running away from you, then you're going to need to get your axe and uh, start mining away at the tree. Uh, I'm not doing all that good on health right now. Uh, we're only at 111. So this is not good. But we should be able to take him down uh, right here. And okay, it's kind of not loading. Please load. And there we go. So we got two fanhorn flowers for that. Uh, so here they are. We have 11 of them now. Amazing. Um, but yeah, that is kind of all that you have to do. Um, as you can see, I didn't really have to do all that much uh, this time because I got a good run where he didn't run away all that much or spawn too many trees. Uh, however, the, two, the trees do take a lot longer than normal maple trees, just to let you guys know. Um, so if he's at like, if he's lower than 20% health, then just keep hitting him uh, and ignore the trees. If he has more than 20 uh, 20% health, then you're definitely going to just want to cut down the tree before he regenerates too quickly. Um, so, basically, uh, that is it. Now, I know that there's, um, that there's some of you guys who just started the game, and if you guys have, uh, been playing the game for a while, you can click off the video now. Um, so, you probably aren't going to be able to do this easily if you just started out, um, but I would suggest at least trying to get uh, an iron sword, even though it's still not that great, maybe an aquamarine, uh, you can do that, 
definitely if you if you're just starting out get the basic bow and maybe try to get the artifact bow uh you're going to need them uh the ruby staff again it's going to be a lot harder without so try to get a spell book um if you can um and yeah it's kind of it you need to make at least one star fruit so just go over to the buffalo core island and keep getting the star fruit uh until you have enough for a star fruit cake and uh yeah you just need the strong stack that you would have i i would suggest at least getting yielded um before you even try the boss because if you don't go fast enough um then he's just going to regenerate too much health and become practically invincible uh, so yeah, that is it for this video. Another short one, I know. Uh, but if you guys enjoyed it, make sure to leave a like, subscribe to his new channel, or you want to see some more Roblox Islands, and everybody, peace out.